channel this is the stitching colorist with Shelley Lewis so today I am filming in the evening time because obviously with the children still being homeschooled a little bit difficult to try and get it done in the day because uh, they're back at homeschooling now so I thought I would film this in the evening I thought what we're gonna have a look at today if we get my camera right is can anyone else see that? Can anyone else see that light there? That's shining through the bottom or is it just me here? Let me know if you can see that. That's funny. So anyway, I thought we would do a bit of... I'd show you my colouring haul where I got for the month. <laughs> that is freaky. What I got for the month of February. Oh, uh, it's a bit of fluff. Hang on. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> it's a bit of fluff. I thought it was something else, but it's a bit of fluff. So yeah, I'm gonna show you what I got in my haul for the month of February. So I didn't get this pencil case. I got this in a previous, um, not sure if I showed it in a previous haul, this one. But in here, um, I did a couple of videos recently showing my mystery bags and boxes where I got in those. And in my mystery bags, I recently got quite a bit of supplies, well, different supplies. So I thought because I wanted to use these supplies separate and try and do a picture with them, out of one of the new books I thought I would show just quickly show you what I got so got a couple of Spectrum Noir uh, metallic markers got some pencils blender balls and we got a couple of Prismacolor pencils there in that one it was a really good mystery bag that I had on Facebook I did have a £10 bag and then the second one I had was a £15 one and it was so good these are all the supplies I had and I had all these lot here. Now I had a couple of gel pens which I quite like these. These feel good and sturdy. I had two of the dual hybrid metallic pens and we know I like them. I had a couple of these pro markers. Some more pencils. Some Stedler Ergo Soft. A couple of fine liners. And we had some white gel pens as well. I had two white gel pens. One is books on and the other one is a jelly roll. And I was so, so happy to get those. Because I really wanted some white gel pens that I could sign my black background colouring books with. So I'm really, really happy with those. So that is the supplies that I had in the mystery bag. So... It might be a bit out of order here because I've got a bit everywhere. So the next supplies that I want to show you that I got this month um, were these. Now I got these from Facebook, from the Facebook colouring selling site. And there was a, sometimes they do have some really good deals. It's where I got my, um, not the same person, but the same site where I got my oh who who's from. Well, there was a person on there selling some unused Black Widow pencils. So I brought this one with the spider on there. Um, I've only ever used these a tiny, tiny little bit once before. Um, when I was doing a colour and meet with a lady by me. That lived by me. So, yeah, I've not used, obviously, these. They're brand new. These are the still in the film packaging. And yeah, I'm really, really happy to have these. I got these two tins for £10 each. So that was pretty damn good. And it's got the colours on the inside of the tin there. I think for a future video I might do a swatching of these. I'm not sure yet because I know the Black Widows have been around for a little bit, especially these. And a few of you already might have seen them, but I've never used them. So, um, besides that once when I've tested one or two. So I thought these would be good to test on a video. 
and with those I got these the scorpion set and these these ones are open Tins are a bit awkward to get in, aren't they? Come on. Yeah, got it. So, yeah, these, they are opened, but as you can see, they are in absolute top fab condition, not being used. And these, uh, is it the black wood? No, they're all black wood, you idiot. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I often have these arguments with myself. So this is the Scorpion set. So I got 48 Black Widow pencils for like £20. So that was a real, real good bargain. Just trying to figure out where to put all this lot without an avalanche. So we're going into a couple of books now. So the books that I had. Now I had this for... Oh valentine's day from my husband you know i love my <laughs> lines dots and spirals some of them i've had a bit of a ooh -ha in the past with them because they've not been that good um but others have been really good now these this book i saw someone post on the lines dots and spirals um facebook page a picture out of these so i went by that and i decided i wanted to get it so i got it well my husband got it now there, on the back that's the back of the book and yeah it doesn't look too bad actually the lines and the dots and spirals in these you probably can't see much there i'm not going to do a detail flip through because it just wouldn't pay to do that i think that's supposed to be like that with the patches i think i think it is so yeah it doesn't look too bad so yeah i'm really pleased with that i can't wait to get a picture coloured in that one so next one is this one the oh you a bit for it there aren't you so the next one is the belba family very very kindly sent me this book for review so thank you so much to the belba family this is mr mosaics secret patterns stress free color by number book with three millimeter sections and this one um is the same one as oh let me just get the book sorry about that so this book is actually the same book as this one the secret patterns so you've got secret patterns advance this one's a puzzle colour by number book. However, the pictures designs are in this book, but in this book they are just um, three by three millimetre sections and it's like a normal colour by number in this one where this one is like a puzzle book. So that is the similarities in between those. Just try and pop this there behind the curtain. And it's going to be a pain in the bum now. Come on, come on. There you go. All right. So that is that one. And out of here, I've coloured one page. My colouring has been slow this month because of recent events. Um, I'm finding it hard at the minute. Uh, you'll understand. Well, I hope you will. But um, I finished this one today, actually. This is what a uh, picture that I did out of the secret patterns. And I'm really pleased with that. And I love it. And I didn't, I've done this one for me Barbara all year which me and Lisa are hosting. So that is Mr. Mosaic Secret Patterns by the Belba family. I will be doing a colouring chat from that book soon. I have got another couple of videos to do. So another book that I got was this one. This is Dots, Lines and Spirals, Harry Potter, colouring book for adults. Um, I... Oh, it might have been on that Lines, Dots and Spirals on Facebook that I decided to get this. And I am very pleased with this. These pictures are smaller. If you wait for that to go into focus, they have got smaller dots and larger dots. So you will get a picture out of that. So, yeah, the pictures are smaller in this book, but that does not bother me in the slightest. At least it won't take you as much time to do. So, yeah, the dots and lines and spirals are pretty good in that book. I've not done anything out of there yet. So, yeah, I'm really pleased with that one. So, the next one I've got, um, I had this for Valentine's Day again from my husband. 
because he knows how much I love Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Um, my funny side of me calls it another book, but I won't say. Yeah, I won't say. Um, reason why I won't say is just in case my humour doesn't come across. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> anyway, leave it at that. So yeah, I got this book. Um, I absolutely love it. I saw somebody do a few pictures from this book on um, the facebook page it doesn't really pay for me to do a flip through because you cannot see anything on there um so i have done one out of here so i'll show you what i've done just so you can get a fair idea of what they look like okay well i did do one yeah, here it is. This is one that I've done out of there. I will be showing it in the end of the months, but that's how the dots are. I think it probably came out pretty good, so I'm quite pleased with that. So the next book that I got was, I was feeling rather sorry for myself <laughs> the past week or two, so I decided to kind of treat myself. So I treated myself to the Easter Patterns uh, Colour by Number book by Prachi Duan Sach Diva. I love this book. I've not started in it yet because I wanted to wait until I showed you the book. But this one, this is going to be included in my... Oh, what is it? The Extreme Scavenger Hunt that I was kindly tagged in by Lauren Loves to Colour. That video will be coming up. It may come up the one after next because I do want to do my finished pages after this one. But yeah, I love this book. It has the normal pictures and it also has the quotes like the Christmas ones. So I'm not going to go through the whole book because we've got a few other things to get through. However, I will be doing a separate, probably a flip through of this. People probably have definitely have almost done it by now, but I'll do it just for my channel. So the next book that I got now, this is an also feel sorry for myself present. I brought this after seeing it on... Lisa's Colouring Corners channel. This is Amazing Geometric Patterns, book one. A fun, relaxing adult colouring book. Now, this is double-sided. No, it's not. What am I saying? It's single-sided and it's got really easy patterns. Um, they're just really fun, easy patterns to do. And as soon as Lisa showed these on her channel, this book, I thought, you know what, I'm definitely going to get that book for... If I just fancy just colouring some simple patterns to do. So yeah, I've definitely, definitely thought I would treat myself to that one. So the next book is, this was the other book that my husband gifted to me for Valentine's Day. This is Smallville, Dots, Lines and Swirls colouring book. I apologise if I don't tell you the art, um, artist on some of these books, it just didn't have them in. Now this book, it's okay. It's not too bad. This one's an okay book. Um, spirals are thin on the thin side, but with fine liners, you'll definitely be able to sort it. I have done a picture out of here so you could see how good the spirals are. Look at that. Isn't that absolutely brilliant? So that is the Smallville Lines, Dots and Spirals. So the next one, <laughs> yes, I got myself this because I love Matilda. I've always loved Matilda since I was as much as I can remember. And I thought I'm going to take a risk getting this book because I do love the film. And if it doesn't turn out best, I'll just colour the pages that are colourable in it. Uh, however, there was some pages like the lines here that are okay. But the thing is, with these lines... I don't know if you can, can't probably tell on that, but with some of the lines in the books where you go like a zigzaggy line to shape the picture, this one doesn't really have that, to be honest. This one does a bit more. On here, you've got a patch missing there. That's not supposed to be missing. You've got a couple of OK spirals and dots, but the re like this one, oh my God. Look at the state of that. That is bad. That's not supposed to be there. So, and 
there's patches missing from this one so if I was to recommend any books I will not tell you guys to get a book if it is no good um so I if you don't mind leaving a few pictures that are not colorable then I say go for it get the book try it out but if you are where it irritates you like this bit here I can work around that but if that irritates you like those other pictures where this patch is missing I don't recommend getting this yeah like this one there's no way I can color that so yeah out of this book I would say more not to get it um now I've got it I am going to color the pictures that I can color out of it but yeah I don't really recommend that one so the next one <laughs> you're gonna laugh at me here I was watching Sonia's Mixed Media and she showed a Shopkins book oh it's not the same one because I couldn't really get the same one it would have been about £20 to get it imported from the US so I went with this one yeah I know guys it's Shopkins who cares I thought I'd just get it for easy colouring not to mention my daughter would probably love to colour with me in this so I got this to do for when me and my daughter want to do some colouring. It's just very, very, very simplistic pictures in here. For even just to test your mediums, for its very simple pictures. So for it, it'll do for when me and my daughter want to colour some pictures in here. So yeah, I thought I've got to get it after seeing a Shopkins on her channel. So the next book, guys, is Fairy Magic, Colour by Number. This is black background and this is by Colour Questopia. Yeah, um, I, what, I like the idea of this book before when it first came out in the normal edition. But I wasn't a big fan of the <laughs> lines you having to do in between the lines. But since coming out with it in black background, it has joined my collection. <laughs> so, yeah. So the next one, because it fell in my basket by accident, you all know it happens to everybody, doesn't it? So the next one I got was Colour by Number Carpet Stained Glass, and this is by Sun Life Drawing. That's it, <laughs> Sun Life Drawing. I've not done anything out of here yet because the books that I show in my haul, I don't like to colour in them really before I've shown you guys. So there is that one. And what else have I got in here? So the other bits of stuff. Now these are the other bits of stuff I had in the mystery pack. I won't go through all of it because there is a little bit there. And if you do want to see what was included in the mystery pack, um, then go back a couple of videos. But I'll show you just a couple of the stuff. Now I've got some card. This is Spectrum Null Premium Black Paper. This is absolutely handy to put behind your colouring pages to protect your pages. So I'm really, really happy with that. I had a couple of colouring pages. Um, I've got some more colouring pages in there. Some more colouring pages here. So I had a bit of a collection of those. So, and they're really good as well. They're like cardstock. So, I'm happy with those. So, I will be colouring those in. Um, now, I've got a couple of stuff I might actually give away in a future giveaway. Because, to be honest, I don't think I'll use it. But I had some disposable paint palettes. Um, I had the Christmas special colouring haven which is issue 55 i had that and one thing that i did not get to show you in my last video that i will show you in this one is this i got 50 nighttime mandalas by camellia angel cover and i got this in the uh, mystery bag as well i was so unbelievably pleased when this one when i saw this in there i was absolutely thrilled with it because this book is actually on my wish list um, to get. So, yeah, I was really pleased when I received this book in my, um, what do you do, in my mystery bag. 
so the rest of the stuff I've got in here I don't think I will go through because I've showed you them in my oh I showed you them in my um, mystery bag so if you do want to see the little it's only a little bit so if you don't want to see that just have a look in the mystery bag thing so anyway guys that is the end of my colouring haul for the month of February <laughs> yeah I started off not getting that much um, but yeah it kind of changed <laughs> so yeah it kind of changed I ended up getting a few things but you have to spoil yourself when you're not feeling that great don't you when uh, life throws you some curveballs so anyway guys I'm going to get going now I hope you've enjoyed the video if you have enjoyed the video please feel free to give the up <laughs> please feel free to give the video a big thumbs up i would really appreciate that if you're not already subscribed to the channel then please feel free to press that subscribe button and the notifications of when i bring the next video out and i'll see you next time with my finished pages and i'm going to get a drink now because my mouth feels like a carpet so anyway i'm gonna get going now guys thank you for watching and i'll see you again soon goodbye for now guys bye